So when you encounter a question, so you may ask them out and discuss with succeeded people. So you go on to apply for school, it's the same. So you want to know how to feel like to study in that school. What's fun, what's unique, what's the culture like? So you might search online, or you might ask these okay. people for some answers, or the best ways to find real people at new design school to learn their real experiences. So Mimi Open is a platform to connect you with a college student or alumni and to learn their real experiences. So our target audience is for the student who want to apply for college and graduate school in the US. So here's our product, it's our platform, so you can know like, okay, what we offer and what's the goal, and you can see how many coaches we have in different, uh, in different schools. And so we have three easy steps. So the first step, to find a coach. So it's very easy to find a coach on our website. So you can do a search, you can search by school, by majors, see all the coach lists on our website. And that's the you can even search by their high school. And so you, that's a very interesting application. Then you can use the field to search like, okay, I want this, Coach study in architecture. Okay, here's the, all the coaches in architecture. And you can just select one. So we invite all the coaches to create platform, uh, his personal profile about himself. But besides that, it's kind of like a LinkedIn profile page. But besides that, we also invite a coach to give a talk regarding his own experiences. So you can click his talk. It's kind of like this. So Jeff is giving his experiences at MIT. So because they're all strangers, right? So all the students that they can see from his talk to see, like, okay. The coach can do a talk, the coach can, uh, can show what he can offer to a student. So if you want to book a further appointment with this coach, you just go on the website and book a time and start a chat on our platform. So our business model is like charge for a service, charge for time, you can also supply the service, and we'll take 10 to 25% from each transaction. And also we can generate leads for other collaborators. And because of the higher education in the US are very expensive, so you can see that you, all you need to pay is like 60 bucks for an hour compared to justify your huge investment like $60,000 for a year. So that's pretty good. So market size, if you take the total number of the high school students or college students, if it, like 5% of them use three times and each time for 60 bucks an hour, so you're looking at like 300 million US dollars. And so we are also tapping into other experience sharing marketers. And so Mimi Open is like English-based website. So we have two branches. So one is the .com and the .org. .com is the marketplace. .org is the content-based site. So .org will generate lead for .com and also other collaborators. And .org, .com and other collaborators will split profit to support .org. And we will also go do the main market. So the .com will also become the marketplace, Mimi Open, for the Great China. And the .org, it's called IOH. So we have been doing the IOH for the past two years, so let me introduce you a little bit. So IOH actually stands for Innovation Open House. So it's like the goal is also democratizing crypto experiences. So you can see that here, so we invite all the overseas Taiwan students to share their experiences overseas, and you can search by major or by school. That's it, if you're interested in MIT Media Lab, you can check out all the graduates from MIT Media Lab. So this speaker will give a talk regarding his own experiences at Media Lab and also how he get into this lab. So it's all free. Because of the social impact, so we won the award of the Keep Walking Fund last year out of 700 applicants. And we are on the press. And also we collaborate with the AIT, American Institute, Taiwan. We're hosting live events like this, like this. So this is an event we host like four, week, uh, four weeks ago. So we used the live event to generate content for online users to watch it. And also, we are on the cover story of the Commonwealth magazine. So it's kind of like the equivalent of Economist in Taiwan. And we are also featured in the documentary. So the title of this documentary is like, uh, Ambitious and Courage, Fighting for the Taiwan's Talent. So that's a press conference. Uh, so it's kind of like everyone know this like had a social impact. So we have two platforms on the one roof. So this is our team. So our team consists of like MIT graduates and also Cornell and Berkeley. And so we have like a PM, our COO has like 15 years US, consult, uh, US software consultancy experiences. And also our programmer also like working in Google. So these are our competition landscape. So you can see that really open. What differentiates us is like we offer real people real experiences. So we are the bridge for you to bridge to other strangers. So they are not experts, but they have been there done that before. 
So this is about me. So I uh, I learned two degrees at MIT. First, my architecture. The other is from Media Lab. And so I spent eight years here. So Media Lab, that like Joe Ito was our, uh, is now like two years ago was our the, uh, director. So Media Lab. So he he wanted to encourage more Media Labers to create their own stuff. So he created an E14 fund. And we applied that last year, and we have been accepted. But uh, because of my visa issues, I couldn't go. So this year we apply again. So hopefully you will see us in the stage soon. And also, you want to talk about the higher education in the U.S., you know the speaker, Tiger Ma. So she wrote a book about how she educated her daughter and entered the IV school. So we met her, and she loves our ideas. So when we are ready, we can call her on our side, on the homepage, and say, oh, I love me open. So here's our progress. So I think Mini Open is not only about higher education, it's actually a micro-consulting. Because like, everyone has something to share. You don't need to be a top-notch expert to be able to share something. So we think that like, we will carry to other job market later. So Mini Open, so we have two websites. So we think by sharing stories and open experiences, we can make the world better. Thank you very much. Thank you. Awesome. Thank you, Mini Open. Yes. It's a special name, like Mini Open. It's a secret, me, me, right? But cannot be yeah. out. Right. Cannot yeah. So it's, it's a complication words like uh, uh, TK is handsome, yes. but has no hair. So it's a little bit of complication. So why did you name me? Okay, <laughs> why did you name the me, me open? Okay, because the year I spent to eight years at MIT, and a lot of people just email us and say, okay, could you share a your test and what kind of research you've been doing up there? But, I but over the time, I, I only have like, time for my friends or friends' friends. I think right. it's kind of unfair. So Mini Open actually stands for the Chinese Mini. Mi. So Mini mi, Gong Gong Kai. Open up your your secrets. So just like Gong Kai Mini mi, down. So you can share your secret sauce to other people. So you give them incentive to do it. So I think wow. that's a goal to open up experiences. Wow! Listen to your speech. It's like listen to rap songs. So so nervous. So, so nervous. So, 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 so quick. Okay. okay. So quick. Yeah. Yo, man. Check it out. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. Don't push the button. <laughs> Don't switch it. No, serious event. Okay. Serious, serious, serious fashion. fashion. Serious, serious fashion. fashion. Serious entrepreneur. Yeah, yeah I'm serious. Not first time, right? Serious entrepreneur. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm serious. <laughs> and also serious. Serious entrepreneur. Okay. okay, got it. Oh, English is so hot. So hot. So difficult. So difficult. So so okay, good. Thank you very much. Thank you Okay, I'll show you. Taiwan, okay, you can speak Chinese, so Taiwan, we can speak Chinese. Next team.